Alright people, welcome back. More Daily Duels. So today is Friday, and that means we are playing Kaiju. This is my second recording, because the first recording went fucking terrible, because I didn't know how to play Kaiju correctly, and I messed everything up. So yeah! <laughs> so hopefully this one goes a little bit better. I didn't open up too hot. Like, I could play Waterfront, and then maybe like MST, uh, and I guess I could remove Brainwashing, send something, and then, I mean, tribute his monster for Radiant, and then remove Brainwashing, but I'm not sure. Oh my god, so he got the Eternal Soul and a Dark Magic Circle, a Stark Magician. Alright, well at least I got MST. At least I got MST, so that's nice to have. So, Choco Magician Girl, I mean, I can get rid of her. Alright, wow, you actually have Pitch Rod. That's surprising. That is very surprising. Such your Eternal Soul, of course. You know, obvious plays are obvious. So yeah, I didn't open up too hot, so. Uh. See, I'm kind of debating on what I want to do. I think I'm just going to go ahead and activate Waterfront. So I can start getting some counters. Uh, hold on to the glow-up bulb. I think I'll just go ahead and special summon the Radiant to his side of the field. And then I can just remove Brain Rousing and take my shit back, you know, at the start of his turn. And then set the MST, set the Solemn Strike. Uh, I don't think maybe he'll activate the uh, the Eternal Soul right now. Like, I, that's what I'm questioning, is whether he's going to activate the Eternal Soul right now. It doesn't matter. It really doesn't matter. I think I should just MST now. Get rid of the Eternal Soul, because I don't want you to have it. Go ahead and get rid of that for me. You could chain if you want to, but just go in the graveyard. I'll go ahead and get my counters, which is nice. Uh, then I can go ahead and summon. Oh, he's just gonna surrender. He's just gonna surrender. I was gonna summon the radiant to high side of field, which I think would have sent his monster. Uh, get get another token. When I have three tokens, I get to go ahead and get a search, and uh, I could just remove bane mashing and take it back. Yeah. You know? Next turn, or I could just search for a stronger kaiju and run his ass over with the three searches. So. Yep, but he scooped it up. So, uh, yeah, get another duel. Bear back. <laughs> Alright. Let's try this again. So, that was pretty good. That's pretty good. No, but I, I, I fucked up fucking Slumber. That's one of the things that I did. I, I, I completely fucked up Slumber. I First, I get the monster, and he gets the monster. So, I accidentally gave him the stronger monster. And I was just like, wow, this recording is so bad. I'm just gonna stop. Why am I ahead? So, uh... Oh, thumbnail, thumbnail. Of course I had to put something Godzilla-related. Like, come on, people. It had to be Godzilla-related. So my opponent will probably end up quitting, but I can go ahead and activate Waterfront, activate Kaiju Files. Um, tribute... Yeah, let me see. I'm gonna activate, activate Waterfront, activate Kaiju Files. Even if you get rid of my, my Waterfront, I can just go ahead and get another one, so still good. Activate this. I kind of want to hold on to the Gamma Seal. I remove two counters? Yeah, remove two counters from anywhere in the field and I get the Activation Banisher card. So, uh, I can go ahead and give him, like, my Dogaran, and then I can give myself Gamma Seal, and then tag out Gamma Seal. Actually, I'm not going to normal summon this turn, so I might as well go ahead and normal summon Pathfinder and tribute it off, get a field spell. Again, get another field spell, and get another top counter. Like, Pathfinder is really good in Kaiju's. Really good. Get you, get you that field spell, like, immediately. So, that's one counter. So then I could go ahead and get to give you this, which, does he do anything? Once per turn, you move the counters, straw monsters, okay, I don't really care about that. So I guess I'll go ahead and give you this. Oh, it's Phantomites, all right. I'll give you this. Then I will give myself two. Give myself this. Then I'll go ahead and tag out my Gamma Seal for a stronger kaiju. Can I activate one of these? I think you can activate one of these once per turn. Your files. So I guess it doesn't matter if I activate multiples. I think. So I guess I'll go ahead and switch out for probably one of the 3000 beaters. Yeah, it's the 33 beaters. So I'll go ahead and get this kaiju. Then I'll go ahead and kill, kill your kaiju. It's like Godzilla, like, oh, rah, 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 rah. <laughs> so I say, you want to activate the freaking card, trap card, increase your attack. Oh, so. Got some counters, that's nice, that's nice. Uh, I think I got enough counters to get a search, so. Uh, who do I have what? I wish there, it would be nice if there was something weaker than Gamma Seal, but I could just go ahead and tag out anyway, so. 
Uh, I'll just go ahead and grab this guy. He's like the intermediate. He's not as weak as like Yamasil, but he's not as strong as 60,000 meters. And he doesn't activate during my opponent. I mean, during my turn, if my opponent has him. So he's a nice to grab the tribute off. So I got a nice 33 uh, beater right now. It's pretty power. And even if shit hits the fan, I could, you know, turn the duel around a little bit. This card be destroyed. All right. That's the one. I don't even know what this card does. It's not the one that you... Yeah, I would say I don't even know what Gauntlet does. I don't think I've really seen any Phantom Knight play that card. Alright. Banish summon your Phantom Knight. Gonna do all your great plays. That's fine. Anyway. Uh, you're looking at the title. Double English is over. Yes, it is. Um, I'm still at university. And that class is only, you know, class once per run. So that's almost over. Like, that's surprisingly. That is almost over. I wonder if he's gonna go for, like, Dark Requiem and kick my shit in. Like, that'd be... That'd be great. <laughs> I mean, I'm assuming Dark Rebellion right now. Dark Rebellion would be pretty great. Cut me in half. No, Utopia, Utopia Lightning? Okay. Okay. <laughs> Different XC. Uh, I was thinking maybe Dark Rebellion. Oh, right. Because if, if he targets me, I can fuck him up. So, Utopia, Utopia, Ray, Utopia Lightning, all that good Utopia shit. Like, of course. Yep. Go ahead and attack over me, but uh, not only am I getting more counters, but I can just tribute your shit and do some more uh, Kaiju shenanigans next turn. Like... It's all good. It's all good. <laughs> yep. Sure. Mm-hmm. All right. Well, I guess these get counters during the damage step, so I don't get anything. So good day, sir. Like, all right. So he has Utopia the Lightning with some counters, and that that's 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 cute and all, but uh, yeah, I could still fuck you up. So I guess I'll go ahead and activate again. Get me a search of a stronger kaiju. Uh, yeah, I'll go ahead and grab you. I'll summon this to his side of the field, summon this to my side of the field. Then, after I kill his monster, I'll just tag out for, uh, for Gamma Steel and start negating shit. So, you can go ahead and have this. Like, you don't need Utopia Lightning. And I'll start getting, I'll get some more counters. Then, I will give myself this. I've already reached the max counters on everybody, so it's about time I start removing some counters. This attacks, like, I think, like, three times or shit like that, but there's really no point in doing that. Three monsters. Yeah, three monsters. Well, I could activate it so he couldn't activate any card or effects, though, because he could activate a trap card and fuck me up if he had it. I'm going to go to main phase two. We'll go ahead and replace a kaiju. What's the other effect? Search a kaiju, spell a trap. No. Uh, replace a kaiju. So we'll go ahead and replace my Thunder King, my Thunder King Ryo. All right, he's going to activate a shield. And uh, give me Gamma Seal so I can start negating shit. I'm gonna have hella fucking counters. I got that remove brainwashing and everything. So, is there any point to activating multiple of these? I'm not even sure. Ah, fuck it. I guess I'll just activate multiple of these. More counters, the better, right? So, look at that. I got nine counters. I don't think my effect is once per turn either. So, I just move three. I mean, move two, banish anywhere. Negate and banish. Negate, banish. Negate, banish. Gamma sales power. <laughs> Gamma Seal's power and tagging out too. Like, hmm, this TCG deck. But no. Uh, community college, the class that I was taking her over. So, the Praxis preparation class, I felt like that class, I really didn't get much out of it, which sucks, because I probably could have got, you know, a lot more out of that class. Uh, I don't feel confident that I'm going to pass the writing test. Like, the essay part, like, I can write the essay. Essay, no problem. I can write a fucking essay. But the, the multiple choice part, I'm not feeling confident about that at all. Like, not at all. Sure. Sure, I guess. I mean, I can fuck you up, so. Like, I can easily fuck you up. Go ahead, select your target so I can just be like, remove two counters, banish. Yes. Activate. Remove two counters. Remove two counters, banish. So, not only did you get nothing, but now your break sword is banished. So. Yep, no effect. Ah, power! <laughs> I, 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 I see it. I see it. I see it. <laughs> so I can only control one kaiju, so that's fine. So you're gonna banish to get a search? I can negate that too. Or I could just negate your trap card. Like, it's really all good. No, I'm fine. That's fine. That's fine. So what, you're gonna get like your quick play spell? No, you're gonna get Fog Blade. I can negate that. Like, I can negate pretty much everything and then, well, it'll get banished. Because the good thing Gamma Seal banishes the card, because if it's sent it to the graveyard, like, oh my god, what do you do? 
you like send a phantom knight from your hand to the graveyard like okay to draw a card okay i see you i see you Ooh, slumber all right uh, i guess once again i'll go ahead and keep searching every turn i keep i keep on getting the kaiju like god they made this deck fucking good so i'll go ahead and grab him start summoning tokens and start getting more aggressive with it so just go attack him with Gamma Seal. Start poking you for 22. He's the weakest of the, the Kaijus, but he's, I mean, sack wise, he's one of the strongest. You gotta admit that. You gotta admit that. What's this do? Special summon it. Okay, so you're gonna special summon it as a monster? Sure. Let's attack you again. Do you get banished or you get back to go back to the graveyard? No, banish it when it leaves the field. Damn, that sucks. I'm not getting any of my freaking counters. <laughs> well, I guess I got max counters in this. I should probably start moving more from this and less from this. Because I only get a counter when I special summon a on the Kaiju special summon. Oh, this is just a card that's sent to the graveyard. So, when I start negating and banishing with, uh, with this, I can go ahead and do this. So, I guess go ahead. So, yeah, I'm not feeling confident. Uh... The curve was really bad. Like, there was one assignment that I didn't want to do because I thought the assignment was stupid, and because I got a zero on the assignment, it dropped me to a B. I did every other assignment, pretty much got 100% on every other assignment, but one assignment I didn't do, I got a zero on, I got, I dropped to a B. Like, that's how bad the fucking curve was in that class. But it didn't matter because uh, it was only a one credit class, and I don't get a grade for it, I just get a P. Did I pass? Yeah, I passed. So, P. There you go. Uh, the other class, I retook English 102 because my grades were... My first time I took it, I got a C, and I wanted to get a better grade. I wanted to get my GPA up. Uh, I had a 3.4 before uh, retaking it. Uh, I passed. I passed and uh, got myself a nice and powerful uh, A. So, uh, not an A minus, an A. You know, my teacher really liked my essay, my project. I got 100% on, and you know, I busted out the. I redid. I retook the class, and I got me that A. I really wanted to get me that A, and I got me that A. So I'm, I'm proud of that. Uh, so, gonna go ahead and send, like, usually Phantonites, I mean, Phantonites are usually power, but when you're fucking dueling with the fucking Kaijus, they handle a situation just so fucking easily, it's just like, mmm, you know? <laughs> oh, I don't know what this card does. <laughs> yeah, I've never seen this card before. Alright. <laughs> so, can I only use the effect to tag out once per turn? Once we turn, you can target kaiju, destroy it, and special summon kaiju with a different name. Cards have filled. You can send this card to okay, guy with three more kaiju cards. I don't know. Oh, I sent it. No, it doesn't say that I can only tag out once per turn. So I can go ahead and tag out for a stronger kaiju monster, and then tag out right back into Gamma Seal. It's just that I feel like I'm going to probably run out of fucking uh, kaiju counter, so that's not great. <laughs> Cause this guy, this guy seems like he'd be pretty good right now. I special summon it to my opponent's side of the field, right? That tree you want to follow the monster, the kaiju monster, I can special summon it. So I can go ahead and give him this, but I think I can only control one kaiju. Yeah, you can only control one kaiju. So even if I remove brainwashing and get him back, it doesn't matter. So, uh, I don't want to take it slow. I would love to end this duel, but I'm worried about, you know, tagging out too much. I guess I think for now I'm gonna go ahead and tag out the Gamma Seal and summon Radian. And then, then the token can get it in too. Yeah. Cause then you get more damage in. And then I can tag out again later. So Alright, oh, I will say what am I doing? Like I'm moving counters. Uh, move two counters to go ahead and summon me a token. Fog blade? No, that's fine. I'll tag out again. Hmm. I don't know who I want now. Uh. You can remove counters. No way to destroy all monsters. No. What's in? This is the one that targets, right? Move three counters in the field anyway. We do. Target. So something's targeting on the field. Destroy it. So I guess I'll just probably just go back to Gamma Seal. Like, no. I don't like that he stopped my play right there. Like, that kind of sucks. Like, yeah, I'll just summon you. Still got a butt ton of counters, so that's nice. 
was just like, you fucking suck. Like, I, I completely forgot about the Fog Blade. I went to summon that token and start getting the token, then switch out and then have the token plus gamma seal, but. Oh, that protects from them from being destroyed. Alright, that's fine, I guess. So I just set this. So I think I got one more gamma seal in deck. So next turn, I can just go ahead and tag out for another Radiant. Radiant removes some counters and then hopefully pull off the proper play. No, that's fine. So, I remove the counter from anywhere and negate that effect. So, when he activates Break Sword, I can just negate him with Kuzu. I mean, Jizz. Yeah. Jizu Kiru? Yeah, Jizz. Just remove with Jizz and then pop if I want to. I would just go ahead and pop your back row because you're sick. I mean, I'm going to negate you, which means that you're not going to turn into anything else. I, I, I pretty got this. I pretty much got this duel under control. I just wish I was a little bit more aggressive. I don't got any of my tuner monsters. Okay. During the other part's turn, when a card effect is activated, tar oh, that targets exactly one. Oh, it targets two. Yep, yeah, targets two. That sucks. Yeah, I'm gonna have to strike you. I'm gonna have to strike you. That sucks. I was thinking that I could negate you, but no. That sucks. That sucks. <laughs> I was totally thinking, I was like, oh yeah, I got this. Like, no. No, I don't. <laughs> probably, actually, you know, I probably should have just let him kill me. He was gonna summon back anyway, and this would have been gone. Then I could just tribute it off his shit and then remove brainwashing. At least if he goes into, like, Dark Rebellion or anything along those lines, uh, that target's exactly one monster. So then I can fuck him up that time. After that, it's like, oh yeah, I can make it. I was wondering why Jizz didn't go off. I was like, oh, Jizz, like, why, why you no go off? Mm-hmm. So, who are these two gonna turn into? Ah, ah, is it once per turn? I don't even think it's once per turn. Any player's turn, and a card effect that really targets exactly one monster you control, and all the way. three counters in the field, and win and destroy. No, I'm good. Two, three. So I'm gonna negate that rank up card. And I would love to pop a card on the field, I'd love to pop that. <laughs> like, no. <laughs> no. I don't want you to fucking rank up into fucking Ophion or anything along those lines of Dark Rebellion. Like, no. I know the power of that fucking rank up spell. Like, no. <laughs> Dark Rebellion next sees the dragon. That's fine. Because you know that you fucking target me and I'll fuck you up again. Like. So I'm gonna get you again. Uh, do I want to try a card in the field? I mean. Yeah. I mean, you're gonna go off despite what I do, so it really doesn't matter. Can you only use the effect once per turn? It wasn't XC summoned, it was brought back from the grave. So, copy. Oh no, I banish you. Oh, you get banished because you revived with the trap card, that's right. That's right. He still got plays for days, people. Like, he still has plays for days. How many counters now? I only have two counters now, oh wow. I only have two counters now. I forgot you could go ahead and search that, grab that back. Yep, there you go. Yep. Yep. And now I ran out of counters. I ran out of fucking counters. I ran out of fucking counters. That is game. That is game. Wow, I can't believe I lost it because I completely forgot that he could use his multiple effects and continue getting searches. Like, yep. Yep, I ran out of counters. I probably should have just let him do something. Probably should have let him do it. Instead, I let him fucking get a search and do that. Wow, that I feel bad. I feel bad. I feel bad because I let him do that. I uh, remember Red watching doesn't do shit. Like, yep. Yep, I let him do that to me. Mm-mm-mm-mm-mm. Ah, oh, that's frustrating. Oh my god, that's frustrating. I can't believe I ran a counter so fucking fast. Uh, I was moving three. But he's just like, oh, yep, still got plays. I still got plays. I still got plays. Like, I probably should have popped the Dark Rebellion, but I wasn't fucking thinking. I was like, oh, Dark Rebellion's not a fucking threat. Fucking idiot. Oh my god. 
I was like, the Dark Valiant's not a threat. It's just gonna sit in there with no XC materials. Totally forgot that he could fucking search the fucking shit again and play it again. Like, oh my god. Uh, fuck, I misplayed. Like, I should have popped the Dark Rebellion. If I popped the Dark Rebellion, like, anything he would have ranked up with that, I wouldn't have cared. You know? Ophion, I don't care. I already have a fucking stronger monster. Whatever, it didn't matter, but. I, this, allowing him to do this, that was dumb. That was dumb, because I ran out of counters and I should have popped the Dark Rebellion. Like, the fucking Break Sword wouldn't even done anything. But I was thinking that he, it might have floated or something like that. It got two materials back. No. Dark Rebellion should have popped him. I misplayed. God, I'm an idiot! Oh, God. I don't even want to upload this video because I feel bad for misplaying like that. But it wasn't a bad duel. It's just, I'm a fucking idiot. Like, that is all that it is. I'm a fucking idiot. I totally forgot he could fucking banish the fuck. I didn't even know he had boots in there. He could have banished the boots, got one, and then fucking did that. I misplayed. I misplayed. I had that duel in the bag, and I misplayed. I fucked it up. I didn't get any Twitter monsters, so I couldn't even fucking Synchro Summon. Because getting Synchro Summon and pushing more aggressively would have been nice, but... And, nope. That was just, that was just totally my B. I fucked it up. Ugh. Fucking just fuck. Ah, <laughs> uh, hindsight is just fucking 2020. 20 fucking 20. Oh my god. God, I feel bad. Mmm, I fucked up. I ate, I ate the fattest of fucking dicks. I ate a fucking dick buffet right there. I literally gave him the duel. I literally gave him the duel. And I feel bad that he says GG too. It's like, fuck you, man. I would have had that duel if I didn't fuck up. Like, I should have popped the fucking Dark Rebellion. Fucking Dark Wackyum. Fuck you. Fuck you. You're an asshole. You're so good. You're an asshole. Uh, yep. Yep. I could have been, I could have been like, no. Negate your fucking shit. Pop. To, negate your Dark Rebellion. Pop your Dark Rebellion. Even if you had searched this and fucking did the rank up on a fucking break sword, what would you have gone into? What would you have gone into to fuck me up? You know? Dark Rebellion? You only have one XC material. You know? Uh, what? Ophion? I'm already stronger than you. Uh. I, I couldn't think of anything. I fucked up. Fuck, fuck me. Uh, I need to practice with this deck. I really do. I need to get more practice with this deck because that was that was bad. That was bad. That was totally bad on my part. So, uh, yeah. Anyway, we call it an episode. But damn, uh, that was bad. Like I need to learn the kaiju cards a lot better. Like I really do. Like if I had Gamma Seal, the Gamma Seal would have been put in that work. Instead, I fucking went into this guy and. Tried to get aggressive with it. I was locking it down, and he floated too much, and he had plays for fucking hours. For fucking days, for fucking years, for fucking millenniums. Fuck. Anyway, my GPA went up. I now have a 3.66, so that's good. Uh, my university class is going okay. I got all my hours done, of course, and uh, just got to start writing them papers. I'm going to keep up with the work. Then I'm going to class. I went to class the first day. Didn't go week two. Didn't go week three. I'll go back the final week. Turn in the book, turn in my papers, and then I'll be done with the class. It's like, it's, it's, like I said, it's only a month long, and then, you know, go move on to the next class, next course. So, I apologize, people. I apologize for losing the duel like that. I really do. Like, that was totally my fucking fault. Ah, so, if you have any suggestions, go ahead and tell me. But, like I said, I've never played Kaijus before. I've never played Kaijus before. So, I fucked up. I ate a fat dick, and I deserve to lose. So, thanks for watching. Thanks for the support, and... I will see you guys next week with some more uh, Daily Duels. Alright people, thanks for watching.